Hey guys, how's it going? Alex K here. Welcome to South Tokyo. Today we're going to visit a really handy store. It's called the Shakuen Shop, or um, AKA the Dollar Store of Japan. Let's go. Alrighty, so we're in the Hyakuen shop or the dollar store of Japan. Um, this place is pretty amazing. They literally sell everything. Um, right now I'm in the home improvement section. Um, they sell anything from uh, water, watering cans to um, all sorts of stuff. Toilet cleaners, clothes racks, all sorts of plastic stuff that you can use for storage. Um, hammers, clippers, uh, everything. I just recently bought some uh, tape. This is a dollar. Wow. So this place really sells stuff that you use in your day-to-day -day life, um, like towels and lint removers. Uh, what else do we have? Um, what is this? Storage bag, um, cockroach repellents, mops, little hooks for your walls. And let's go on to the other side. Over here they are loaded with a bunch of kitchen utensils, kitchen timers, um, kitchen tape, all sorts of drainers, and lots and lots of stuff, scissors, and what is this? This is for crabs. Wow. You're gonna crack open some crabs and eat it. And a bunch of handy stuff, all 100 yen or a dollar, close to a dollar. So this area, the stationary section, is probably the most, um, the section that I use the most. It has everything from pens, pencils, sharpeners, tape, erasers, anything you can think of that you would find at a stationary store, all for 100 yen. And it's really cool. Um, this place is really handy for probably students and stuff that just need some tools or things to get done, um, like projects and stuff. Uh, this section I don't shop that often, but they do have a little food section. Um, they sell stuff like, you know, ramen or a bunch of instant stuff. They have um, little condiments here. What is this? Um, oyster sauce. Hmm. 400 yen. Uh, Kochujan. Um, cinnamon sugar. A bunch of stuff. Um, I don't know. About buying food for a hundred yen so I don't usually buy stuff here but it's cool that they have some I guess you know which has okay oh we haven't gone over this but little um, porridge mix I forgot to check down here they have a bunch of um, snacks like potato chips um, other little bag treats and um, instant noodles I guess these I can consider buying for a hundred yen um, since you know they're wrapped and not expired <laughs> Fake flowers, anybody? They're pretty beautiful for being fake 100 yen flowers. They also sell little um, things to put them in. And a bunch of flower supplies. And, well, I guess most of these are decoration. This section is absolutely um, handy. They sell dust pans and uh, fly swatters, rubbish bins. Um, what else do they have? They have little brushes, um, hose nozzles, weird, <laughs> and um, what's this? Magic dusters, all sorts of household equipment that are necessary um, in day-to-day -day life. So you don't have to go to the Home Depot to get, um, well they don't have Home Depot in Japan, I don't think. I guess it's, what's it called? Um, uh, I forget what it's called, but anyways, you could get them in here at a 100 yen store dustpans and all sorts. Sunglasses, anyone? This mirror is for sale too, I think. Not this one, because it has stuff written on it, but... This is one unique thing they sell in Japanese 100 yen shops. These are um, hanko or inkan. Little stamps with your name on it, pre-made. So if your name happens to be in here, um, which is likely if you have a Japanese name, then you can just buy one here for 
Um, not quite 100, but 150 yen. Over here they have a little bit higher quality um, rack of Hanko or Inkan. Let's see if I can find my name. My last name is Kobayashi. It starts with a Ko, so let's see. Focus. Oh, it's gone. Just kidding. There's an entire row of Kobayashis. So, yeah, these are Inkan. Let's take a look. Oh, so it's like this. One hundred yen fireworks. Um, okay, really? Well, it's like a pack of fireworks. I wonder if these are actually safe. And of course, what would a dollar shop be without toys? Little balloons, bingo cards, marbles, um, ohajiki, um, police cards, magic wands. Um, all sorts of fun little toys. What is this? Shotgun. Toy shotgun with little plastic darts. Uh, and more toys. We've hit the summer season, so they have a rack of pool supplies or beach supplies. Little um, floaty rings and um, Flip flops, swimming goggles. Can't believe you can buy these for a dollar. This is a swimming cap, and yeah. Stickers, stickers, Super Sentai stickers, Pokemon stickers, Lameshiba stickers, more Pokemon, and a uh, One Piece. Alright guys, that is it for today's Sub Tokyo. Uh, thanks for watching. Now you know where to go to find something handy and small when you come to Japan. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm Alex K. This was Sub Tokyo. Uh, remember to hit subscribe and leave comments and suggestions below. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter at SubTokyo Vlog. And make sure to check out our blog at subtokyo.blogspot.com. I'm Alex K. This was SubTokyo. I'll see you guys later. <laughs>